Greetings everyone. Manupatra brings to you the news highlights of 21st February 2023. Starting with the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court has held that employee cannot request for alteration of date of birth after a long delay and especially towards the end of the career of an employee. The court while observing that no one votes on the basis of education qualification has held that false information regarding education qualification of an election candidate cannot be termed as corrupt practice under Representation of People's Act 1951. The court has held that though the general power of attorney holder cannot delegate his powers to another person, but the same can be delegated when there is a specific clause permitting sub-delegation. The Supreme Court, while observing that DNA tests of children may be directed only if there is prima facie material to dislodge presumption under Section 112 of Evidence Act, has held that children have the right not to have their legitimacy questioned frivolously as it is part of right to privacy. The court has launched live transcription service in CJ D.Y. Chandrachut's courtroom on trial basis. The service will use artificial intelligence and technology powered by natural language processing to provide live transcriptions of its hearings. News highlights on the High Courts The Delhi High Court has held that Delhi government's decision to restrict the total number of visits by family members, relatives, friends and legal advisors with jail inmates to two times a week, keeping in view the number of under trials and prisoners, cannot be said to be arbitrary. The Kerala High Court has commenced publishing of judgments translated to Malayalam language on test basis. Two judgments of Division Bench in WA1638 over 2022 and WA926 over 2016 have been made available in Malayalam language on the High Court website. This concludes the news for today. Thank you so much.